What's going on camping nerds? I've got another brand new shipment in today. This one's a couple's coach, but it's very, very accommodating for bringing guests. This couple's coach does sleep up to six people. This is the all new 2025 Grey Wolf 23 MK. And with our fantastic financing options, we can get that in your driveway for as low as $218 a month. We do ship anywhere in the country. We actually ship internationally. Shipped overseas many times, we will do it again. This thing is 29 feet, zero inches, tongue to bumper, and 5,063 pounds. We got one slide on this guy. Out here you see we have an outdoor shower. Left of that is your black tank flush below, fresh water and city water connections. You got your 30 amp power supply down below. And then at the very bottom, you got your gray tank and black tank flush. Those are both gonna hold 38 gallons. Those are both gonna hold 38 gallons. Your fresh tank is gonna hold 52 gallons. Your low point drain is to the left of that. Cable connection up above here. Like always, we got stabilizer jacks, four, one in each corner. And then up front, you got your battery connection. We got dual LP propane. We got dual LP tanks here, 40 pounds, 20 in each. Back around to the camping side here, you see we got a little underneath storage. This does not pass through. However, we do have a lot of space in here. 30 amp power cord here, hand crank for your awning and your slide. If your power's not working and you need to crank that in, use the hand crank. Awning here is 15 feet wide, blue LED strip under that, and then we have two outdoor speakers. The usual TV mount right in the middle here. You got your outdoor power outlets, outdoor TV hook up there, outdoor cable hook up here. Down here next to our dual axles, we got an LP hookup. If you wanna hook up a propane grill, barbecue out here, throw yourselves a little tailgate. You got the mini fridge to the left. Little, uh, little ice tray in there too. And then, oh, an uh, actual ice maker. So looks like they're allowing you to make quite a bit of ice here. Outdoor shower, outdoor faucet, that's handy. Shower right outside. Uh, that's that's gonna come in handy for rinsing off your dog's paws, rinsing off the muddy feet before tracking mud all up uh, throughout the camper. Very convenient. Right by our entrance here, you see we got a leash latch. Per usual, it'll hold up to 1,500 pounds. Hook up one or multiple dogs on that thing. You got your fold down rack in the back here. Some great extra storage. Of course we have our spare toy directly above. Big old window, uh, but we do have a camera, backup camera or security camera, and then a mount for a ladder. And no, unfortunately the ladder is not included, uh, but we can get you one ordered. Let's pop inside this honker. Yeah, quite beautiful, gotta say. Pretty good looking stuff here, guys. Nice kitchen and living area when we walk in here. Kitchen here, got everything I need. I love the sink areas in these gray wolves. Always hooking me up with the farmhouse style sinks here. Always hooking me up with the big old thick cutting board. These things are getting real thick, gang. And I am not complaining. Love a good old thick cutting board uh, sink cover. And you know, they don't stop there. Below, roly-poly dish drying rack. Bartending barista cup cleaner outer sprayer thing. Yes, that's the technical name for it. Detachable faucet. It has a um, soap dispenser, hand sanitizer dispenser combo. One rinsing tray. Um, two rinsing trays. Rinse some more items. And then look at that honeycomb pattern in the sink. Very sleek. Totally decked out farmhouse style sink here. To the left of that, you see our three burner gas stove. A uh, little glass cover. Keep that folded down when you're driving or else it will break, it will shatter. You see uh, we have an air fryer. That's down here. It looks like a microwave, acts like an air fryer. Uh, does both. Fridge here, get ready. If y'all haven't seen these yet, get ready. You can open it like this or you can open it like this yeah and then the freezer you open it like this so you know a lot of ways to open this thing sides bottom uh and opening it from this side is really handy if you're like coming from the bathroom here if you got to grab your shower beer or like toilet beer or something then you know Super accessible from your bathroom. Uh, right below our refrigerator, we got our fuse box here. To the left of that, battery disconnect, power down, power up. And then below, you see we got our uh, propane alarm. I like the cabinetry in here, I like the glass. Pretty good amount of storage in this kitchen. 
Uh, back to the very rear, we got our couch. Couch is surrounded by big old windows here, zebra shades. If you haven't seen these, or if you want to see them again, um, you know, you can do you can do full shades, you can do half shades, you can do quarter shades, or no shades. Uh, they're all like that. Pretty fun, I think. Really easy to use, just roll them up and down like that. But yeah, huge windows here, emergency exit on this one. This couch does work as guest sleeping. It is a jackknife sofa, really easy to pull out. One hand, grab underneath. It's like a futon, pretty much. Uh, if you are in a pinch, you can use these armrests here as pillows. I wouldn't recommend it. I'd recommend like just bringing pillows, but if you don't have extra pillows, you can use those. Otherwise, nice little like foot rest there if you want. My only qualms with the this couch is don't get a great view of the TV from it. I mean, it's not terrible. TV would be right there on that mount. But if I am on the farthest right seat of this couch, this might get in the way a little bit, but it'll play. We, if you're camping, you shouldn't be watching TV anyway. You should be outside. You should be out there frolicking and playing and having a whimsical time with your family. And then you and your family can come in from your whimsical time and gather around this nice U-shaped dinette and have a beautiful meal. Again, we got the zebra shades, so we can let a little more sunlight in here. Let those golden rays leak in. A uh, big fan of the U-shaped dinette, always. If I'm at the bar or the restaurant, I'm always picking the corner booth. It's the most social booth. And you gotta love them in a camper because they always convert into sleepers. Wow, now you got a bed here. Big old double bed. Does have a USB and USB-C port here so your guests can charge up at night. And then another great thing about these things, they always have these big drawers underneath. Super duper deep. One of these on either side. And then of course you can store stuff just underneath there. Peep in this drawer. Right next to the dinette area, we got our fireplace. This is uh, kind of weird to me. It doesn't ruin the camper for me, but this is just kind of an awkward space. I'm not gonna pretend it's not. I'm not gonna be like, oh, look at this very aesthetically pleasing space. No, that's not aesthetically pleasing. If you don't care about that kind of thing, good for you. This is an amazing camper for you. That bothers me a little bit though, guys. Maybe I would, I would maybe personally just like make this part this much shorter. Uh, on that side to not block that regardless 30 inch fireplace here kicks out some heat out of the top this is a space heater as well your mount for your tv and then you got your cable you got your power we have these speakers on the ceiling uh subwoofer as well that's all controlled by this sound system down here which will also control the speakers um outside finally before we head into the bathroom you got your thermostat here Control your AC up above, control your furnace down below. All right, let's hit the bathroom, let's hit the bathroom. This is a full pass-through bathroom. You must pass through it to get to your bedroom. One of the benefits to that is if you're bringing guests, you have all this separation between your bedroom and the guest bedroom, which is just your living area. Um, just more privacy, whole room in between you guys. And designing it this way allows it to be a really spacious bathroom. Standing next to the shower right now, we still got all this floor space here. Corner vanity, some good storage behind our mirror. We got a linen closet here, keep your towels. Some more shelving behind our toilet here. Just a regular plastic foot flush toilet. Full size though, it's a big toilet. Across from the toilet, there's our shower and then there's more storage for towels and you know, whatever you want. These ones are really deep actually. Goes all the way down here. Some very deep closetry here. A little travel lock on our corner shower. Sucks to do with one hand. I recommend doing that with two. Regular old corner shower though. Big old skylight, great natural light in here. And it's not terrible on space in here. I've been in, I've definitely been in smaller corner showers. And lastly, we'll uh, head into the bedroom. This door is directly across from the door we entered in. Nice big old king bed in here though, look at that. Great little bedroom. I'd say we have just enough walking space around either side of the bed. Got some nice windows in here. No zebra blinds in the bedroom, just the default, default skin. USB, USB-C outlet. Big old wardrobe on the side here, you can hang your clothes. 
you know, you got your classic above storage. Pop lights, you can use those for reading. And then we also got a lot of storage underneath the bed here. Just to lift this up. You see in the center, it's just wide open. That'll actually connect to that outdoor storage from earlier. So there's your power cable and hand crank again. To the sides of this, we got two bins on either side. So these bins can be accessed from above like this, but they're actually still accessible with this closed directly from the side here. To pull them out, you know, keep your socks and undies in there and whatnot. If you got any questions on this camper, call now. 231-788-2040. We're at 4500 East Apple Ave, Muskegon, Michigan. Uh, you can also check out our website if you want to see like any of these other guys. I'll be cranking out videos on all these, so stay tuned. Peruse the channel, peruse the website. A lot of fun stuff out here. Oh, and the offer for my last video still stands. Um, if you buy this or any other camper on the lot after watching one of my videos, as long as you're the first one to do it, you will get a free 75 inch 4K smart TV. No, I'm not kidding. First person to buy anything here, literally anything on the lot. As long as you watch my videos, you show that you uh, found us through the videos, you get a free TV, 75 inches, 4K smart. Uh, remember, we ship nationwide, ship international. Great financing if you need financing. Get it to you for two eighteen a month. Two eighteen a month, we can get that sucker to you. So, come and get, come and get it.